<laughs> hey gemstones welcome back to my channel beauty beyond all things that enhance your beauty so tonight i'm here um this is your girl take so i'm here to basically just do um a wig review for you guys so the wig i'm reviewing tonight is ashley lace front gina um she's another outre wig and i really love this um you have seen gina before i had gina on in another video um which was one of my my outfit of the day number seven and I'm going to go ahead and put Gina on. Gina is just like the regular lace front. You know, the two combs in the top. Um, comb in the back with the adjustable straps. She also has the, um, I'm going to show you guys the, she also has like the little bendy tabs on the side. Which you can just um, bend down or you can bobby pin. And I really, really like Gina. She is a nice wig. A very nice, like, wrap. And that's one of the things that I really, really like about this wig. Um, it's just a very nice straight wrap style. And I don't do too many straight styles often. So I decided to do that. Now the only problem that I had with Gina was the fact that Gina um, is shiny. And I don't know if you can see that, but Gina has a shine to her. And... Um, she just needs to be dulled out a little bit so I'm going to definitely try to uh, dull her out maybe with some baby powder or maybe like some cornstarch or something but she needs to be dulled out a little bit I definitely like the flow of her she has a nice flow um, as you can see um, especially for a wrap you want the hair to flow you don't really want it to be like stiff um, I'm the one that put this part that she has right here. I put the part in her. And you brush her hair down. Now, I had Gina, when I had Gina on before, I had Gina, like, just hanging on one side. And I had this side pent back with a flower. Or you can just kind of brush this hair behind your ear type. And let the hair flow over. You can rock Gina like this. There's so many ways you can rock Gina. Um, she's very nice. Okay. Let you guys see how long she is in the back. She's about this long. Okay. So, I just like the way that Gina flows. She has that natural flow of a wrap. And I know I keep saying that, but I just, I really like this wig. This is another good wig. Um, lace wig. I'm very happy with the purchase that I made with this. Now, I got Gina at my local um, beauty supply store, but you can probably find Gina um, online, any probably hair stop and shop or anything like that. You can definitely probably find Gina there. Um, this is the packaging. Packaging, packaging. This is the packaging for Gina here. And Gina looks like this on the front. Now, I got Gina in a color number two because they didn't have her in a 1B30, 1B30, 1B33. They didn't have that at the store. So I just went ahead and got her in a color number two because I have decided to lean towards the color number twos a lot more. I used to be in the dark colors. And the color number two just seems a lot more um, natural. And actually, my hair isn't even black. And actually, my real hair is actually lighter than a color number two. Um, my hair is close to maybe um, a four. And so, um, but I do like the color number two. The only, again, the only problem I had was that uh, Gina was like a little bit too shiny. Now, as for shedding, okay, running my fingers through her. And I only got like this one piece of hair here. So, shedding wise, she's good on. She works really, really, you know, well with any versatile, with any style. Um, you probably could like pin her up a little bit, you know, maybe uh, twist up some sides or something and pin her up or something real cute. You could do that. Um, I wanted something that's light and airy, something nice to rock um, down. You don't always want to rock a hairstyle and have to rock it up or put a hump in it or any of that. I don't. I know that's like a go-to style, but sometimes you just want a wig that you don't have to do any of that too. Um, so that's another good thing about Gina. Um, the flow of her is just great. Like I can say that again. I can also say that the hair is soft. There's hardly any shedding. Again, I feel like she's a great outre purchase, a great lace wig purchase. Um, she is synthetic. You can't put any heat to her. 
Um, and again, a color number two, and this is the tag of her, and this is Gina. And this looks like a 427 that this girl has on here. Um, now, parting room, I think that's about as much lace as you're going to get right here to part. Um, the hairline-wise, I do like the hairline on this wig very much so. Um, and as you can see, it has like a small dip in here. I do like the hairline on this wig. Um, she's not thick. She's not very thick. She's, but she's not like super, super thin either, where you're just like rubbing the scalp of the wig almost. Um, to me, she's not. Um, or you can look right at the scalp of the wig, basically. Um, she's not like that. She, but she is like very light. Um, airy, not like a hot wig. You could definitely wear this out if it was super hot or whatever. Um, but anyways, I love this wig. I think she's very, very cute. I love the color, um, that I got. I think that the color fits me well. Um, and she does come in a right variety. Like I said, I got mine in my local BSS for, um, I got this with this wig and, um, Daisy for like maybe 40 or 50 something dollars together, the two lace fronts, because the guy gave me a deal because I shop there all the time. So, but I'm running in here to give you guys just a sh quick review. Also, I um, if you want to see anybody else, one of the with Gina on, um, the only person that I could think of to shout out is Joanne Gray, and I ran across her because I heard about her from um, Much Love, and then I ran across her channel and I went ahead and subscribed, and um, she did a video on this lace front here, lace front Gina. And, um, Gina's, like, well worth the money. I, I really think she was worth it. She's soft. The wrap, it's a beautiful wrap cut. So, definitely be sure to check out, um, Gina. And I will have all the information down below, um, or whatnot. And I will try to have the link to Joanne's video so you can see her video, too, um, down below. So, um, anyways, y'all, I am out of here. I love you guys so much. And, mwah, bye.